All right, this quick video, we're going to review the uh, PDF report to Excel converter. Um, notice down here, there's no icon that you'll see with the uh, PDF icon. Um, when you double click on this, it's going to kick it off. You're going to get a note here saying it's it's basically starting up a couple things. And then it's, see this uh, PDF icon here, it's showing you that it's actually running. Um, the very first time you run the program, it's going to default to your My Documents. But after that, it'll use the last folder that you um, used. So I need to navigate to where I have the uh, files. So I'm just going to navigate here. Again, once you do this once, it'll remember where you kept them last, um, which I figured is the, the smartest approach. All right, now you can select mul one file. You can select multiple. It doesn't matter. And you hit open and that's going to basically start the process and here you're going to notice the Excel files update and then once it's done it down here it should uh, well it looks like it didn't close out I'll have to double check and make sure that it goes and closes out but it should exit after running once just because I figured basically you're gonna run this thing once and hey if you have to run it again you just double click it again and, and pick the files you want to convert um, the good thing is when we go open up these files you'll see they're looking pretty clean right so it'll be easy to, to copy and paste the data let me move this over a little the data um, to another worksheet it's taking the, uh, the the last file looks like I didn't finish that grabbing that um, it should be taken the, the this date here uh, and put that as the name but um, right now, let's see, that is the one, I think it's getting that date from the file name. Um, that's what I, this, this 1817. Um, but for now, anyway, that should get you a lot faster than uh, what you were doing. Um, just make sure here at the end, you can right click and hit exit, or I can hit, hold down shift and hit escape. I'm just going to hit exit here, and I'll close that out. Every once in a while, you might get some warnings that pop up, just hit um, it doesn't really matter yes or no. I need to close out of them and let me know if you have any problems.